Hi, welcome to the Online Jewelry Academy. I'm Professor John R. and I'm your instructor. The Online Jewelry Academy regularly posts online tutorials covering beginning and intermediate projects and techniques. If you like these videos, you can support the production of future videos by subscribing to Patreon and making a monthly contribution to the Online Jewelry Academy. You can also support us by clicking on the button in the lower right hand corner of your screen. Once you do, you'll instantly become a subscriber to our channel. And don't forget, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And sometimes there's some gems on those sites. In this video, I'm going to talk about this shape, the shape of an individual link of a drawn chain. Now, what's a drawn chain? Well, remember at Christmas time when kids would take strips of paper and put loops into loops to make a chain? Well, this chain started out just like that, but to take on that interesting elongated profile, the chain was pulled through this tool, a draw plate. But what do you do when you have a loop that's this big? You probably need an enormous draw plate, and I don't have one of those. So we need a different solution. Now, in future videos, I'm going to utilize that shape in a variety of projects such as these. Let me show you how to make it. It's really easy. What you're going to need to do is you're going to need to place your loop into your bench vise with the solder joint touching one of the jaws of the vise. Then all you do is you just crank the vise shut and go slow. And what you're going for is a, a shape where the two sides, those touching the jaws of the vise, become parallel to one another. Look, it took me just a few cranks and there it is. Now you can adjust this with pliers if you need to, but as you can see, this shape gives you the opportunity to make a wide variety of interesting projects. I hope you like this quick tip. There are many more like it on the onlinejewelryacademy.com. Don't forget to subscribe on Patreon. Thanks for watching.